I'm at our favorite spot, Costco. I need to do some damage with grocery shopping. I am armed. I have my list with me, my grocery list. I just made a meal plan and I'm going to poke inside Costco and see all of the new stuff that they have. I know they had a ton of Christmas stuff last time. They probably have even more this time. So let's go check it out. Also, I got my favorite parking spot again. Don't let me forget to get vodka for my homemade vanilla extract on my way out. I keep forgetting. I've been here like, I don't know, more times this month than I care to admit. But right up front, they've got the banging deals. $16.49, normally $21 for 186 paper plates. That means Thanksgiving is coming up, right? But they also have Thanksgiving themed plates. They have this immune support liquid IV. I love this stuff. I don't necessarily love this flavor, but it's great for immune support. And it's a hydration multiplier. I love Liquid IV, 24 sticks for 23 bucks. The normal price is $29. Ooh, they've got some protein. And then this is my favorite sale. They have the Pantene Pro-V shampoo and conditioner on sale. It's normally $14, which is still a screaming deal for the amount that you get. 38.2 ounces in there, but it's on sale for 10 bucks each. And then they have the Neutrogena body oil on sale. I have a core memory about this. The woman across the room in high school for me, I worked at CVS and she was checking out and she had this body oil and I was like, oh man, I should get, and I have never gotten it. I just, light formula, light sesame formula. What does this feel like? A luxurious moisturizing experience? I don't know you guys, it's 20 bucks. It's normally 25, which is still a great deal. I'll just keep on dreaming. They have Neutrogena makeup removers and Hydra Boost wipes. Normally 22 bucks, they're on sale 17. And then the CeraVe, oh my goodness, it comes with a pump. Normally $25 for two of them, which is again, screaming deal. Number five today, but it's on sale for $20. The Vitamix, I saw that there's a sale coming up on this. Okay, I saw in the pamphlet that they send out, it's like $100 off, that makes most sense. In my mind, I wanna say it was $200 off, but that just seems a little bit crazy. So the Vitamix will be on sale for the holiday season. KitchenAid, I'm sure this is, will be on sale eventually, $400. Oh, they have two colors, red and silver, uh, gourmet stuff. None of this is on sale, but I'm sure eventually everything goes on sale, right? Ooh, this would be a great gift, the immersion blender with like a whisk and it's got all kinds of attachments in there. Ooh, the lint chocolates, uh, yes. And then they still have some of these Halloween candies. $20 for the amount of chocolate that you get is crazy. I have to put together some teacher gifts, so I'm gonna grab some of that. Oh yes, new holiday stuff. Okay, fun stuff. You get eight packs of these kitchen towels and they come in cute little holiday prints. Okay, so these are the four prints that you get in this pack, two of each. And then here's some snowflake happening. Ooh, some Christmas trees. I can dig that one. And then this one, I don't know, this might be a different brand. Ooh, I see red. Okay, and then the red one, it says ho, ho, ho. If I think that's all of them. I should grab some of those, but I won't. I'll leave it for you. Okay, these are great too. Stocking stuffers, if you're buying for a bunch of like your kids' friends or something, this would be great. An eight pack of these mini squash mallows. My kids still love these, the large and in charge ones. I'm like, they are overflowing in your bedroom space, but you get eight packs of, eight of them for $17.50. Oh, here's the, the other pack down here. I was trying to look for a variation. Did we see these two? I feel like there's a lot of cute ones. Oh my goodness, they have a little dog blanket. Oh wait, do they have a stuffed animal dog to display it on? It's stuck. It is zip tied. How am I supposed to see what it looks like on the dog if they zip tied it like that? There, wow. Somebody call Vogue. Whoever set that up definitely needed help. Okay, 15 bucks. All right, we've got ladies straight leg jeans. These are buffalo, $16, normally $20. They have a couple different washes, light, dark, and then black. Here are some sweaters. It is sweater weather season. I mean, not really in Florida ever, but you know, we can try in the early mornings when it's like 60 degrees. 10 bucks, normally 13. Ooh, this is going rampant all over my Costco Instagram feed. Um, this has a hood. It's a Nautica jacket and it's really 
uh, quality, I guess. Ooh, I like that they have a couple different colors, black, green, gray, and they're $28 right now on sale from 35. They have the men's stuff over here. So like these fleece, Alex actually really likes these fleece, um, I guess jackets, sweaters. I don't know what they're called. Pullover. Okay. Normally $15, still a screaming deal, but it's on sale for 12. And then they have men's pants. Ooh, everyone needs a good pair of pants. I actually don't know if Alex owns a pair. They're not on sale. Otherwise I'd grab him some of these. Oh my gosh, the zipper pocket, supreme. I actually love this casual look. How come none of the men's stuff is on sale? Just kidding, it is. Okay, men's fleece jogger. This is on sale, the jogger. Wait, this is a sweatshirt? Oh, are these the legs? Okay, anyway, they're Pumas and normally 20 bucks on sale for 15. I love a good sweat pant. I don't know how much those are. Oh, I guess these are on sale too. They're the pants. And then these sweaters or pullover again, they feel really nice. Gray, blue, black, 17. Shackets for men. They've been wearing them for centuries. These are $20, comes in a few different colors. They also have them for women. You know, it's, a, it's all the rage these days, these shackets. Ooh, also these pants. These are ladies scoop a pant and they're 13 bucks. A couple different throw blankets. This one is normally $18, it's on sale for 14. And this one is $15, pick your comfort. And then they have these huge pillows. We have so many pillows on my bed, I wanna get rid of half of them. And none of them work, none of them. I woke up this morning and I was really feeling my age. I was like, wow. Anyway, they have these, not really sure. If, ooh, wow, a fur rug, 80 bucks. There it is, five feet, 10 inches by five feet, three inches. And don't forget a blanket for your pet. It is waterproof, that's pretty cool. Furniture protector, oh my gosh, look at this little guy. <laughs> the snow, mud, and rain, mm, love it. He's an outdoorsman, 19 bucks. We've seen the Christmas trees. I'll link my previous Christmas shop with me below. So I'll just quickly scan over them. Decent prices when you're looking at like Christmas trees and stuff. Costco probably has some of the best prices and they're super large. They have garland. I think we've seen all of this. I'm only gonna highlight the stuff that we haven't seen like this holiday plush gnome, 40 bucks, normally 50. I feel like we just have to look at these just because it's the holiday season. I think he's fixing that tree over there. All of this happening, the stars, the Nutcracker. Oh my gosh, that Nutcracker, $350, way cheaper than the one at Home Goods. And it has, sings and it lights up and it, I mean, unbeatable price. Anyway, I've been waiting for a sale on these, but they are quickly depleting, so I might snag one. They are $119. Amazon, the cost on Amazon is way more, and it lights up, and I don't know. I like it. I love it. I want some more of it. I just don't know if I'm going to have room in my car. I brought Alex's car. It's a lot smaller. Anyway, these candles, flameless, they're on sale. 20 bucks, normally 25, and even 25 is a screaming deal for the amount that you get. I even tried to find some on Amazon, you know, for my Thanksgiving tablescape, because I'm going all out, and I could only find like the skinny ones, still got them. Ooh, smart Wi-Fi string lights. I don't think we've seen these. They look kind of futuristic. $60, and you get 36 feet. Oh, is that, is it time? Is it time for us to buy some Christmas lights? I think I'm going with these. I think we're gonna be this house, the fun house. I think we saw all of this, maybe not this, recyclable? Okay, gift bags, sacks. I'm sorry, aren't they all recyclable? Is this news to me? I thought we could just recycle bags. 20 count in here, they're $18. Okay. Here are all of the prints included and different sizes. Wow. I love these name tags too. They're so dang cute. Oh, and there are, wait, these are holiday cards. I thought there were more boxes. $13 for 40 holiday cards. Does everyone personalize them? Not anymore. Not anymore. Wait, not anymore? I don't know. You pick whatever you want to do. We always get a picture because sometimes that's the only time our family gets to see us. You know what I mean? Our extended family and all that good stuff. They have pillows, $10 for an assortment of decorative pillows. 10 bucks for a pillow, I'm gonna tell you, I just went to Home Goods and TJ Maxx and all that good stuff. $10 is a screaming deal number seven. $9.99 for this holiday outdoor mat. They've got gnomes and the red truck. Can we think of something else, please? 
I just heard a couple arguing over pillows. They're like, we get them every year. Then then the dogs shred them to bits. And she was trying to be like, yeah, the dogs aren't allowed on the couch anymore. You're trying to talk them into it. Anyway, these are actually really nice um, rugs. I don't know if these are indoor or outdoor accent rugs. $20, I guess if you keep them, um, you know, away from the weather. But there are four different ones and I love them all. And don't forget when you're out doing your holiday shopping, Costco has diamonds. Diamonds are a girl's best friend. You know what's a girl's best friend? Grocery gift cards, okay? That's what we really want. Gas cards and all that good stuff. That's my best friend, I'll tell you right now. But if you are willing to spend $1,500 on that necklace, because that's what they really want, you go ahead and come on down to Costco. Also, if you didn't know, Costco sells iPhones and an iPhone these days is like $1,300 too. So <laughs> would you rather have a necklace or the world in the palm of your hand? <laughs> okay, Monopoly. I've been waiting to see this. I've been seeing it all over the grams. It is Monopoly, but Costco edition. Costco Monopoly, stop it right now, it's $40. So that's my only hang up, but it looks amazing. <laughs> also had a bunch of Legos if you didn't see that. We saw the Play-Doh kit last time, but not this sensory bin, or maybe we did, but I didn't take a good look on it. This is pretty amazing. It's $20, it does have the asterisk. It's a sensory bin with, I don't know, all the messes you can make in the world. Uh, give your kid 10 minutes and it'll be all over your house. They also have squash mallows activity kits. This is the Play-Doh I saw. I told you it was gonna go fast. This is like the last one, $50, but it comes with like a hundred things of Play-Doh and a million pieces of things that will, you know, accessories that will end up everywhere. But that's pretty awesome. Hey, Fashion Angels, they have the ultimate tie-dye kit and workstation. This thing is 30 bucks. That would be a really good gift. And then on this side, I think we saw, uh, maybe not that, hold on. Pixar's take on a squash mallow, but they have like Star Wars. Okay, I can dig it. And then they have all the action heroes, whatever they're called, like Superman, or whatever it is, Spider-Man and Hulk and Iron Man, all that good stuff. And then I honestly, if my life depended on it, couldn't tell you any of these people. Is that like the fish from Nemo? I don't know. Wait, hey, I'm staying alive. That's Sully and Mike from uh, Monsters Inc. Nailed it. Hey, 24 bucks for that set. And then Tasty Junior, $35 for the Mini Chef 4-in-1 play set. This is actually really cool. Okay, hold on, it comes with a toaster. Try me. Okay, a little mixer, a blender. Oh, this is awesome. And then an oven set, love that. I love when they have these Disney kits at Costco because they're such an affordable price. How much is this? They're clearly going out because the tag isn't even up. Deluxe doll set is $35. Look at everything that you get, the whole tangle. I don't, why did they include the mother? Because mother knows that. They could have included, I don't know, her actual mom. It's kind of bizarre. Anyway, that's cool. They also have the Little Mermaid down here. Ooh, Frozen, that's a good one. And then Encanto, they have this Barbie set. It's $50. It comes with, oh my gosh, Oh, it's like a vet center. Oh, I love this. It is a vet. You can even bathe them. Oh, this is the cutest. The Squash Mallow Pandemonium. They have Stitch. I don't understand why he's so popular. And they also have Stitch, but as Elvis. Oh, I sounded just like him. Okay, they also have, uh, what is that? Guacamole or something. They have a taco, they have pizza they have i think sushi sushi and corn oh my heck they have it all right here at costco these are like 12 dollars for your future dj they have a beat board and this is 50 dollars wait it's a game well i guess it is fast on your feet balance challenge Ooh, okay i thought it was like mixing beats you know tuka, tuka. guess it's not basketball is always a steal here an axe throw they brought that back because they didn't sell out of it i guess i saw a cornhole set here's the magic a laser x ultra this is 50 dollars. it doesn't come with vests okay so that's the main difference i was looking last year online versus in store but if you don't care like i guess it goes with the 
blaster or whatever. I'm not really sure, but $50 for a set of four. So a group of four can play. That's pretty cool. And then they have the ultimate magic trick. And this is on sale. $24, normally $30. I was also hoping to see this too. Okay, $250. Do you see it up here? It's incredible. I love that they have full grown adults hanging out in here. This is a bumper car, extra large, $250. It's, that's just too much for my kids. They're having the time of their lives and who can blame them? It's fun for the whole dang family. They are 12 volt battery. It comes with the LED lights on the bottom. I wish they had one to test out in store. I mean, obviously I understand why they don't. Max speed is 2.67 miles per hour. You're gonna be cruising for bruising. Now this is giving me nostalgia. This is what I wanted every Christmas for my entire childhood. Obviously it didn't look like this. It was white and it was a pure punch buggy. Man, it was the coolest. Never got it though. $280 for this green Volkswagen electric buggy. Wish I could punch you because green punch buggy, no punch backs, all right? It's up there if you can see it in the flesh. And I just think this is incredible. What's the top speed on this? Let me see. Not intended for off-road use. Well, what a shame. It's also a child's toy. Well, I'll challenge that. What is the weight limit? It doesn't tell me a top speed. And I'm a little disappointed, okay? And then secondly, aren't they all electric? <laughs> boogie, woogie, woogie. Hey, speaking of electric, I found this Phantom Scooty. It is an A8 electric scooter, battery management system. It's got a whole bunch of stuff that's happening over here. Up to 28, okay, 28 mile range. I thought it, that's how fast it went. I was like, oh my gosh, that is a brain injury waiting to happen. $239.99 for this thing. Avelina has been asking for one for years and I just, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> All right, over here, some more random toys. And this one is catching my eye. I don't think we've ever seen it before. It is the XL Mega Rex Monster Truck. It is $75? Forget it. <laughs> you can't even ride it. These are made out of foam. What does this do? What does this do for $75? I don't know, but it comes with a remote. <laughs> and then this thing is $25. And it uh, has four lights and sounds and posable dinos. Worth it. I can't believe I haven't shown you this yet. It is a Star Wars virtual pinball. It's $700. But then they also, like, this is a, like, real. It's real. They have Pac-Man 2. And this one is a steal of a deal at $600. This is like a full-on arcade game. You can have this. That's crazy. All right, I think we've seen it all. Xbox, PlayStation 5. We might be getting one of those. Play at home on the go system. What's this, a Switch? That's only 400, wow, what a screaming deal. Super Mario Brothers. Man, I love Super Mario Brothers. Peaches, 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 peaches. Ooh, all right, this is a portable wireless party speaker. $200. Pump up the jams, pump it up. Ooh, a singing machine, this is 200. They also have musical instruments here at the Costco. Pathfinder Go, this is 65 watts, three sound speaker. Uh, this little doohickey is $100. And then Avelina was actually asking about this and I was like, you know what, I think I saw that at Costco. It's a MetaQuest uh, virtual reality headset kind of thing, $370. Listen, as they get older, their gifts just get more expensive, you know what I mean? Ooh, they have Atari here. They have PlayStation Backbone. PlayStation Back, is this new? I don't know, it's $100. They hold it up front for you. And then, ooh, uh, the gaming chair, $170, comes in gray and black. By the way, the Atari system down there is 80. Ooh, super soft socks. These are women's lucky brand socks. They're on sale for seven bucks, normally 10. I have found that when I just come, you know, by myself, I usually have a kid or two with me, but I don't normally come down like all these aisles. I just beeline straight to the food and get the heck out of here. But so it's always fun to do a shop with me. These we have seen, I don't know, I, a couple months ago or so. Ooh, a five piece set. It comes with some wooden utensils. And this is, I want to say $50. And it comes in two colors. What's in the box? They already got me. Great marketing right there. But what is in the box? It's a Ninja Woodfire outdoor grill and smoker. Are you joking? 
This little doohickey will set you back $290. That's the normal price. And then they have, not they, this is a different brand, not Ninja. This is 60, normally 90. Pretty good, what is it? Air fryer, griddle, and a smokeless grill. This is wild. And yes, what the heck? I got this off Amazon, you people, and now they have it at the Costco. It's the S'mores Maker. The S'mores, like flameless, kind of sharper image thing. It comes with a tray. It is so fun. The kids really loved it. You can stack on anything that you want in there. Peeps, Reese's. I mean, we did all kinds of different stuff, and it was fun, like mixing and matching flavors. You know, getting out of the traditional sense and, you know, switching it up a little bit. But anyway, $20 here. I want to say I spent a little bit more than that. And by a little, I mean probably double. Oh my gosh, I've been waiting to look for this. I finally found it. The Beast. The Beast Blender Deluxe System. It is $150. And it's strong inside. Best in class blending performance. It comes with a couple little travel containers. I kind of like that. And that's uh, pretty much it. I feel like I haven't seen this before. A foodie possible cooker. Maybe it just has a new color or something. This is a hundred dollars and it's perfect for entertaining. Chili for up to 20 people is making me laugh. This, that's every night for us. Nine pounds of spaghetti and meatballs, pulled pork for 30 sliders. That's a little crazy. 14 cooking appliances and tools. This is what this is supposed to take over. This can replace your slow cooker, steam oven, <laughs> get rid of your oven, a food warmer, non-stick pot, a sod tape, and get rid of all of this. And all you need is the Ninja, cast iron skillet, a saucer, steamer, saucepan, stock pot, Dutch oven, roasting pan, bread maker, <laughs> integrated spoon. You don't even need your spoons anymore. This is amazing, all for the low, low price of $99.99. These are great and they're selling like hotcakes. $60 for two Dutch ovens, you people, two pack. The white ones are nearly gone. The red ones are on their way out. Come on down, 60 bucks. Actually, I have been looking into getting a stock pot just because some things I make, I need more space. This is an 8.3 quart stock pot and it's $30. There it is in the flesh, nice and large and in charge. Ooh, mixing bowls with lids. What the heck? $25, you get a four set of mixing bowls and they're stainless steel. Oh my gosh, I just want the food inside of it. The holidays always bring out the colander set. So this is a three-piece colander set. I kind of like how nice they look. Very streamlined. Oh, 20 bucks. Oh my gosh, did I show you this? Did we see this last time? The Florida cutting board. My favorite. Hilarious. 20 bucks. Last time I tried to use my thermometer, I think it was broken. Anyway, here's a set of thermometers because you need way more than one. $30 and you get, I don't know, all, all of them. Do you need all of, is this necessary? I feel like it's a little overkill. Hear me out, just when I was thinking, who approved this purchase for Costco? <laughs> Six pack of animal mugs. A couple behind me were like, oh, look at those animal mugs, perfect for gifts. Listen, I'm not saying I don't want it. I'm just saying, what? I think I'd much rather have this four pack of mugs. It's bringing me back to the 70s, $17. I guess they come in two different colors. Could they not think of like a different color to paint these? I don't know, giving me 70s vibes. If you're into that, they're here. This aisle is popping. This is an 18 piece I design kitchen and pantry storage set. There's nothing to show you in the flesh, but it is $99 and you get 18 pieces. Hold on. Here's a breakdown of all of the pieces that you get inside. Oh, wow. And then the first time I've seen this, two hand-woven serving trays. I mean, you can use these to corral a whole bunch of stuff around your house, 30 bucks. Love these serving trays. There's a set of two for $19. So they come in a couple of different colors, just all white. And then they have the white with the blue on top, giving it a little interest. They seem to whip out this garbage can every year. It is a simple human, $99.99, dual compartment step can. Let's test it out. Oh, wow. That's real nice, okay? Eight piece set, it's a silicone set, and this is $15. Oh my gosh, screaming deal. Blue is the only color I see, just kidding. I also see gray down here. Very nice, I like. Hey, I found another blanket. Oh my gosh, I can't, like there's no way I can even see the price up there, that's ridiculous. I'll, I'll try, I'll try to look, but it feels nice. 
Ooh, wow. $30 for that rug. $30 for that blanket. Also, there's a Cutco uh, guy trying to sell knives. Cutco, amazing. Uh, anyway, so that would be a great Christmas gift if you're looking. They also have these. Someone ripped it out of its uh, compartment here. For good reason, trying to test it, trying to try it on. $20 for these ladies' cardigan, and they feel like a dream. Love the burgundy tucked away in the corner over here there's a jumbo lounger i feel like we have something similar to this we got it at a garage sale holy crud i just looked at the price 150 dollars i want to say alex got it maybe facebook marketplace or something like that definitely secondhand and nowhere near 150 dollars okay the kids love it by the way they jump on it it's like a, a whole thing they love every second this avelina has been wanting but she wants the one with like the bulbs i was like can we just not okay five hundred dollars it's on sale normal price is six hundred and i feel like even that is a deal i don't know you guys like i don't know what to do she is a full-blown teenager my poor bank account i've made it to the food but only because i went a really weird way i don't see anything new and interesting so far but i do smell garlic so there's that I'm always grabbing the tortillas. Ooh, the perlines. You get three containers of them for $10.69. Oh my heck, screaming deal number four. European cookies, shortbread cookies, all the cookies. Oh wow, the clothes section. They had to expand it a little bit to accommodate all these uh, sweaters and jackets and stuff. So I think we saw those up front. These are $16. Oh, wow. And then they have a cozy women's wind haul full zip up, please. Uh, it's Columbia. Okay. I love these nutcracker ones. They would make great like teacher gifts or neighbor gifts or $10 a piece, you know, the front office gifts or something like that. I don't know. What are they even filled with? I don't know, but they're just so cute. I guess, what do you do with the container when you're done with it? Nothing. Oh my gosh, this is $11. And can I tell you, don't buy it unless you're willing to devour this entire confection. It is so, oh my gosh. I have a lot of restraint right now, not getting this. Obviously these are the best on either side. The, no, I just, all of them, all of them. $11 for baklava. Mm -mm. Oh, they have the gingerbread house again. I wonder if they have the gingerbread people because that was a hit last year at our gingerbread decorating extravaganza. These, it, this is a pre-built ready to decorate, which honestly, Thank you so much for doing that. $14. This caught my eye because it is a gorgeous color. I love how it has like the halfway turtleneck. I'm sure that's called something. Oh, it's Jessica Simpson and it is just a sweater and it's 12 bucks. You can barely get a sweater at the thrift store for 12 bucks. You know what I mean? It comes in a couple of different colors and honestly the color options, well done. They have a good assortment of holiday dresses for the little ones. And then they have the jackets up here. These are really nice too. Comes in red, white, black. The dresses are $20 a piece and the jackets are 35. Ooh, the book table is some of my best. Pete the Cat board book set. Love a good board book set. Hold on, they're coming to set some stuff up. Who is? What is world history? Those books are great too. And uh, yeah, they're, they're really wanting me <laughs> out of the way. Pinball science. All right, well, that's not as interesting as like Pete the Cat for me. Wait, fashion through the ages. This is the best one. If I see things like that on Instagram where it's like hair through the ages. I'm like, yes, Milk Street Simple. All right. Ooh, the joy, the joy of Costco. We saw that last time. Someone made a choice. They were like, um, instead of Atari, I am going to get Elon Musk's book, right? Tom Clancy over here. Oh, we've got Build the Mermaid. How do we build a mermaid? One fin at a time. I know, is that it? What's in the back? Build the Mermaid. Oh, that's cool. Princess Collection, $29 for this. Jane Austen, The Constitution and other writings. Oh, wow, a real page turner up in here. Christmas books. Dasher can't wait for Christmas. Me neither, man. Me and Dasher, we're like this. Bluey, it's a Bluey Christmas box set. I'm sure this is selling like hotcakes. Love a good hotcake. How the Grinch Stole Christmas. We've got a couple more up there. Ooh, elves are the worst. 
Oh, I don't like the negative language. The box sets that they put out during the holiday times, so great. They've got all kinds of collections, the Babysitter's Club, Judy Bloom, Goosebumps, that's all I see, Minnie, Mickey, Big Nate, all the good ones, all the greats. Oh, they also have Peppa Pig. Epic six book adventure set. This thing is so heavy. They've got Dr. Seuss up in here. They have all kinds of stuff. And then Ghirardelli Squares, the peppermint kind. Someone made a choice, good for them. $14.89. Ooh, I can't wait to put Christmas gifts together. Look how cute those are. Peppermint bark, caramel, sea salt caramel, the Ghirardelli. Oh my gosh, wait, why are these going out? They have the asterisk for $11. How many do I get? I can eat like five at a time and then go in for another handful. So I don't know if that's for me. Hey, they have this advent calendar again. It's $19 for how many pieces? I assume like what, 24 pieces of chocolate? I don't know, I'd rather get that bag, I think. And then they have European chocolate, the Merci truffles, Belgian luxury chocolate. Here's one I haven't seen before. The, ooh, this looks really nice. Artiston, $13. Oh my gosh, the Fiero collection. This is where it's at, $15 for that. I'd rather get this. 42 pieces, screaming deal. Hey, look what I found here. Very, very cool. It is a bonfire, the fire pit built for the backyard and beyond. It is $330, and I feel like that's a pretty cool portable option. You know? What I mean? Okay. Whatever perfume someone is wearing near me is taking me back to my college years. Cranberry walnut bread. I feel like this is a specialty holiday item. Feels really uh, bready, dense, delicious. Nine bucks. It's pretty good. Another holiday find. Raspberry walnut chocolate arugula. I still, I still don't understand that with cream cheese chocolate no nah, i still don't know uh anyway these are great and they are 11 dollars. these are literally the best things i've ever had in my entire life look how these are just drenched in powdered sugar two of these so eight eight of them for 12 bucks just get them one time if you don't like them just give them to me and i i think i'll be happy about it so this is a six pack of mini cakes it's nine dollars can you see it's kind of freezing i wonder if these were previously frozen they are caramel apple. Mm, wow. You know it's the holidays when Costco busts out the cranberry almond bark. This is $10 and there's chocolate on the bottom, obviously, with some white chocolate and cranberry and almonds on top. Seems pretty simple to me, but that's why Costco sells it, okay? And then over here, oh, just normal cookies. Oh, and then they have the, um, the sprinkle cookies, funfetti cookies. This looks like a great dessert to me, mixed berry and cheese. $10. Did I say dessert? What I meant was breakfast. And then they have a spice pumpkin loaf, pumpkin spice loaf. Kind of looks like they're cornbread. I bet it tastes way better because they're cornbread. Sucks. This is their ready to bake chicken pot pie. I got it one time, you know, for experimental purposes and stuff, just to let you know. Um, it is delicious. It is and, and huge. Everyone ate it in my family and they loved it. So there you go. The price is, I mean, up there, but it's a whole meal and it'll feed your whole family and probably have leftovers. And it's like around 22, 23 bucks. A couple new things that I'm very excited about. This is my favorite, the cranberry jalapeno meatballs. They're chicken meatballs, I think, yeah. And they are, oh my gosh, best flavor, the best one. It does have a little bit of spice. And then this, they have a Greek style with spinach, feta, and red pepper. These are like chicken burgers. These are $14.50 and they are, I haven't had them yet, actually. I bought some. I think they're gonna be great. Finally, a new dessert. I haven't seen this one yet. Oh, and it has the asterisk. I don't know, I've never seen it before. Pecan apple slice bunt cake. That's a sweet looking bunt cake and it's $11.79. And then the tiramisu, I think they're in glass too. Yeah, they're in glass jars. $7, normally 10. I love this, it's like make your own charcuterie board. Ooh, someone made a choice here. They were like, Gouda, get the heck out of here. This is $13. It's an assortment of cheeses cut into perfectly portioned squares. And then they have the antipasto Italiano. They've got prosciutto, salami, I don't know, all kinds of salamis and stuff. This is $13. And I mean, put these things together with a couple of crackers and you got yourself a party. 
a few soups for this season. Chicken tortilla soup. Oh, I wanted to add that to my meal plan. I totally forgot. Uh, $9 for two containers in there. And then they have this chicken and mushroom soup with Minnesota wild rice. Hey, wild rice, that stuff is not cheap. $10. And then this one I haven't seen. Ooh, someone took it out. Is it a sample? It is fire roasted vegetable and barley. Mmm, delicious. $10.69. They have lobster ravioli, spinach and cheese ravioli, pulled pork up there. That's great. Grab some pulled pork, corn, and sweet Hawaiian rolls. You got yourself a dinner. I'm just saying. They've got some schnitzel, beef kebabs. What was new over here? I wanted to show you this. Flautas, chicken and cheese. Mm, I'm going to devour that when I get home. 14 bucks. They always have a lot of dinner options laid out up here. That seems so good. And then I look at the price. I'm like, oh my gosh, will that feed my family? You know, am I going to have to buy two? Anyway, so ribs and chicken wings and all this good stuff. Actually, decent price on the wings, considering if you go out to eat, it's like a dollar a wing. It's crazy sauce. So I've heard, I don't know. I like Hooters, but I haven't eaten there since I was pregnant. That was really my only good reason for being pregnant. Okay, anyway, this is a Southwest wrap. There's only one left because it is delicious. I'll just say that. It was good. And then chicken sandwich on sprouted grain bread. That's good too. I've had that. Mm -hmm. I haven't had this. I don't know what it is about the tortilla with the stuff inside. I don't know. They just get soggy so fast. Not for me. Not a fan. Never have been. Never will be. Also, their chicken salad. Grab some croissants and you have yourself a lunch. They have the quesadillas and the gyros that you could throw together. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot. They sell chili and it is delicious. It is so good. So if you're in a pinch, if you're in a pickle and you need dinner for 13, 14 bucks, grab some chili and you're good to go. Also, it is flu season. So they also have their soup out, their chicken noodle soup. This is great. My only complaint, oh my, someone is screaming. My only complaint is that there's not enough broth. I like a lot of broth. Give it to me with a whole loaf of bread. That's why I can't go to Panera. They don't give me enough bread, you know what I mean? Uh, anyway, but if you add broth to it, it is supreme fantastic. That's what I always do. What the heck? Oh, I didn't think I was going to see these. Okay. These. Oh, I have to swallow. I'm salivating loaded mashed potatoes. I'm going to try these. I just shared my ultimate holiday mashed potato recipe with you. It is not like a loaded mashed potato, but I've heard these are fantastic. So, you know, I got to give it a try. And then they have the meatloaf and mashed potato. Fantastic. By the way, I shared that recipe on Instagram. Okay, what's new here? Steamed spinach, oh, creamed spinach. I feel like we got that last year. Nothing to write home about. I mean, it's creamed spinach, you know what I mean? All right, Jack, I'm gonna give you another try. It's been a while. Just thinking about how I packed all my grocery bags in my other car and uh, look what I found. Some shopping cooler bags. They're $7 and I love how they're Florida themed. Oh my gosh. The Skyway Bridge, is that what that is? This is amazing. Or was that 60? I don't even know. And then this one, they all, they're all like Florida themed, which I'm loving. Oh look, it's uh, Clearwater Beach and all that good stuff. Oh, it's actually a four pack. Four packs in here, easy to clean, limited edition. Seven bucks, screaming deal. So for Thanksgiving, they did away with the whole like 200 count with the big plates, small plates, and then a hundred napkins and they came out with this hundred pack of oval plates great surface area specifically for thanksgiving and these are 22 dollars for a hundred amazing i don't drink soda but i think this is just so fun that they sell the like bottles of coke like this in the glass bottles i think it's nostalgic and it kind of reminds me of the holidays so those are 32 bucks this is great too. It's hot chocolate season. So you get 50 um, packets in here for $8. I much prefer the large can where I can just like dump it into a different canister or I like to do the crock pot hot cocoa, but not homemade. Like I do Swiss Miss, but I just dump half the canister in there. You know what I mean? But if you do individual packets, that's a great deal. Screaming deal number three. I love that they always put this out too. The sparkling cider. This is... $12 for a four pack and Wentworth talks about it more than probably anything else in his life. He's always talking about this cider. Thinks it's so fancy. Okay, if you're into bubble tea, they have this. It's $14 for eight cups. Oh, all kinds of yes right here. $15 for 32 bake at home 
Godiva ganache filled chocolate chip cookies. Just saying that. Mm. This is the first time I think I've seen the pepper jack cheese here, like in slices like this. That's pretty cool. It is $8.80 for two pounds. Oh, and then they have cheese sticks. I was actually looking for those. Guys, cheese is so expensive. You guys know these are some of my favorites, the Annie's Organic Cinnamon Rolls. They are unmatched to any other like refrigerated cinnamon roll. They taste homemade. There's no like artificial like film in your mouth. I don't know, they're just the, the greatest and the best. You get a three pack here for $15.50 and then they always have the crescent rolls. Like, you know what I mean? When you eat these, you feel that ick in your mouth. 40 rolls really hits the spot when you're feeding a crowd, but the Annie's unmatched. Amazing. Brownie brittle. Ooh, also the honey made. I didn't know they sold those here. $9.79 for probably a hundred. Okay, what I wanted to show you over here is apple crumble blossoms. So this looks new to me. $13 and you get 12. Ooh my gosh, they're fully baked. I could eat 12 of them right the heck now. Where's my sample? Does it count if I just bust inside the box and just start eating? It's a sample. Ready in 50 seconds? That's dangerous. Let's do it. So many dangerous things. Okay, wafer with foot. What am I looking at? Kit Kat. Kit Kat ice cream, $10 for 16 cones. And then down here, the peppermint bark. That old Saint Nick with this peppermint stick. How does it go? Pe something with a peppermint stick and old Saint Nick. Peppermint bark. Holy crap, it's freezing in here. 14 bucks. I got a peppermint stick for old Saint Nick. That's how it goes. Nailed it. We're all gonna be making pumpkin pies and stuff soon and all the pumpkin stuff. And uh, they have six cans of organic pumpkin for $9.59. Is that a screaming deal? Number two. I won't mention the Ghirardelli brownies because they're the best brownie mix ever. But I will mention these Lily's dark chocolate baking chips. They're new, they're dark chocolate, but they're Lily's, the Lily's brand is like no sugar added, which when you think of a chocolate chip, you're like, mm, how do they do that? Uh, well, it's dark chocolate. Actually, they also have milk chocolate, which I don't know why Costco wouldn't do the milk chocolate ones. I feel like that's why these aren't selling. Okay, uh, but I did buy some, so there's that. I haven't made anything with them yet. $9 for 24 ounces amazing and then they also have this is actually the best deal these semi-sweet chocolate chips this is the costco brand 4.5 pounds for 10 bucks did i buy pecans last time i came can't remember i haven't shared this in a shop with me but i did share it on my instagram i have yet to eat them but they are selling kirkland brand the chicken breast chunks like the just barely naked or whatever the heck this is called just bear those little nuggets which are similar to um, Chick-fil-A, what people always compare them to. They have the Costco brand, which is the same price as what that used to be. Now those are $18. These are the normal price, what they used to be before, you know, the pandemic, before inflation, all that good stuff. So $13.99, incredible deal, screaming deal, number one here at Costco. This would be a great appetizer. Oh, you only get 16? My gosh, they're so pricey. Shrimps are expensive. This is bacon wrapped sweet chili shrimp. I feel like we could recreate that. Mm, sounds good, but it's $15.50 for 16. I could eat 16 pieces just by myself. They have this berry blend almond thin cookies. They also have gingerbread cookies. These are $7.50. These Tate cookies, I use them um, for a couple of things, but like as a s'more replacement, a graham cracker replacement, those are great. And they're 12 bucks here at Costco, which is a fantastic deal. Oh yeah, the Stroop waffles. I should do this to replace uh, a graham cracker for a s'more. They've got the Stroops here, no price yet, but honestly, they're priceless. A little better bang for your buck here, and you're still getting something that's bacon wrapped. They are real good. They're also on sale for $12, normally 16. You get 18 bacon wrapped stuffed jalapenos. Mmm, I could eat that. I could eat probably 10. We know Costco always has this amazing screaming deal on the mega Nutella jars. $15 for two of them, like blows my mind, okay? That's a toothache waiting to happen. I eat that stuff like pudding, it's dangerous. But this is the first time I have seen the Biscoff, oh, I just poked a hole in that, it was completely unintentional. $13 for two of them, and it's the Biscoff cookie butter. 
Oh my gosh, reminds me of a flight. Wait, people are putting this on pancakes? It's a great idea. Give me a loaf of bread and I'm in for the night, you guys. Th these are three bottles, 500 milliliters each, of dipping oils. So they're normally $25, they're on sale for $20. Um, Italian herbs is one of them, Greek herbs, and then garlic. I mean, how can I? How can I resist? It's a no-brainer. Let you know how it tastes. They have these herb seasoned classic stuffing. It's a three pack. My mistake is I always buy this and then only ever use one. Actually, what is happening in here? What is it? What is this recipe? Uh, I'm pretty sure I need it. Is it on the box somewhere? Three great recipe ideas. Oh my God. Well, three recipe ideas, three bags inside, and that's how they get you $8.79. Hot sauce collection, you get 12 three ounce hot sauces and that is the perfect gift for a dad i'm saying i don't know why it is i just know that it is 19 bucks they also have this truff oil black and white truff oil 17 dollars and 69 cents you guys i don't understand i just don't what is the hype i guess i need to try it to get it but i'm not willing to spend 18 dollars on this i guess i don't care enough to know I just got some teriyaki sauce with sushi rice. This is the rice. I actually bought this for convenience when we make lentils. And here's the teriyaki sauce. It's the Kinder's brand and it's really good. You get a whole bottle for $6.59. Check out this truff oil. So they have more truff oil. You guys, I'm gonna try truffle oil one of these days and then like rave about it for the rest of my life. $15 and this is the hot sauce. Okay, that rice is lacking a protein. Okay, I saw actually saw these when I was shopping around with Avelina, these carrots at like TG Maxx or something. And I was like, oh, should we should get it. Anyway, $13 for three of them. This is pickled asparagus, pickled carrots, and pickled okra. <gasps> Alex loves pickled okra. I should get this for him for Christmas. Remind me. I bet it'll go on sale between now and then. I'm very weary of this. Golden pineapple and coconut water. Wait, is it in glass? Okay, that makes it a little, what? I don't know, I can't tell. It's like plastic glass, I'm not sure. How can I not know that? Anyway, it's in coconut water. Yeah, you know what? It's very intriguing, actually. It's $7.59, should I try it just to uh, experiment? I think I'm gonna hate it, so I'm gonna leave it. And then also, this kind of sketches me out too. Like fruit in a jar, I don't know. This is the best price I've ever seen in my whole life on chicken noodle soup. It's an eight pack. It's on sale right now for $7. At Publix, one can is like four bucks. It's insane. That's pretty cool. Now this is what I'm talking about. Zebra popcorn. It's popcorn with a chocolate, I think. Yeah, caramel corn with chocolate flavored stripes. How can you resist? $8. I mean, I can resist because I don't really care about it. I do love chips. I love the chip aisle. I can just get sucked into all the chips. Chicken skin crisps? Stop. And the brand is Flock. I don't know how I feel about that. Hot Nashville seasoned. 13 grand? This is wild. This is crazy. Is this real life? $8.89. And you get like, I don't know, a handful of chicken skin. Why did I grow up thinking that these were the most expensive candies ever created? <laughs> they are actually on sale right now for $11.69, normally $15.50, and I don't know, you get a lot of them. This is where the magic happens. The coconut almonds, chocolate covered coconut almonds. I haven't bought these in years, and uh, my thighs are thinking me. But they also came out with the Girl Scouts Thin Mints Bites. This is essentially what is in the middle. Crispy center with mint and dark chocolate. All right, I could dig it, $12.60. My aunt and cousin were texting me at the same time about something similar to this, but it was the um, Kinder brand or maybe Nutella brand or something like that, where uh, it's a similar cookie to this, milk chocolate enrobed wafer with hazelnut cream in the middle. And they're here for 11 bucks. I don't think I'm gonna get them. My aunt and cousin really want me to. <laughs> The Moors, these are great. They're clusters and I got them last time so I won't be getting them again. $9 and then those are always great too. I wanna say they have a lot of added sugar but I mean, yeah, eight grams of just added sugar. Sometimes it's so unnecessary when they add it. But you know, makes for a good treat, seven bucks. 
These also make for a good treat and Eleanor asks for them every time. These 16 pack Nutella and Go is $15.69. And then, ooh, someone left their Starbies. Nutella, be ready, you get 36 in here. These are great for the movie room. 14 bucks for 36 of them. I think that's the better deal, but I don't know. Still a ton of sugar. Nine grams of added sugar. What about this? 20 grams of added sugar. Oh my heck, that's crazy, that's wild. How do they sell that? I mean, I get it. It tastes really good. Okay, what's the difference between these? What's happening? This is Kinder Bueno Mini Krispy Kreme Chocolate Bite. $9 for that. I had these. I got these at one point. How much added sugar is in this piece of crap? Oh my heck, 12 grams of added sugar in one piece? Oh, five. Still, what the heck? Oh my gosh. 10 bucks. Here's a healthier option. It is toffee, almond, and sea salt snaps. Oh no, here's a real guilt-free option. It's plant-based protein with some nuts and berries on it. Let's look at the added sugar here. Still seven grams. Well, if you're eating dessert, what do you expect? <laughs> a sea salt pretzel bar. Cool, live the sweet life. Yeah, that should be my slogan. $10 for these. So long since I've seen Milano's 32 cookie packs. It's like a third, not 32, but two packs of cookies. You get 32 packs, okay? $11.79. Mmm, pretzel crisps. It's the holiday season. White cream and peppermint for $9.49. It's my first time seeing this winter cheer nut blend. It's $11 and it's so full of flavor, it's nuts. And to think I almost didn't come down here. This, the, okay, oh my heck, I'm so happy to see these. I love these. They are the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink and they really wear amazingly. Uh, this red is giving like all the holidays, right? So you get a three pack for $20. Oh my heck, here they are on the lips. I mean, do I wear lipstick? Not really. And I have a couple colors of these. I may, might even have this one at home. I don't think I do. I think I have like birthday and something else. Anyway, do I want them? Yes. Am I gonna get them? Maybe next time. They have the original makeup eraser and this is $20 too. People rave about these. I'm just saying, I don't know. They've got the finger paint sets and then it's the holidays when Costco busts out the Holiday Wishes four pack of hand soap for $12. Well, 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 Ava NYC. Invisible dry shampoo, two of them for $10. I feel like this is screaming deal number negative two. This is like a sister brand to a company with like similar packaging. I just can't think of the name right now. But then they also have this 10 in one hair primer bottle. Mmm, $20. I see this at like TJ Maxx all the time. But the dry shampoo, like I actually use that, you know what I mean? It's gonna make my hair fall out. Couple cute things. They have this three pack of wet brushes. Oh gosh. And the three pack is $20. And then they also have this, it's so cute. Bath balm and body wash set. This is $20 as well. The bath bombs were a hit last year. I got them on mega clearance. It was like a pack of 10 for $2. I don't even know. They definitely did not make money off of that. And if they did, it's like, how are they, you know what I mean? Like the inflation that they put it out. I'm just saying bath bombs and body wash set in princess form is also $20. So that is it. That's all the new stuff that I found at Costco. Hope you enjoyed shopping around with me, seeing and exploring. I'm debating in my head, like, should I go back in and get diapers? And also those little Christmas trees because they are selling fast. I don't know if I have space for them. I might as well just go and get them while I have the chance. No, 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 I'm just gonna think about it in the car for a minute. But that's it, if you want to subscribe, put a little happy in your day. I'll see you next time, bye.